<laughs> Hello, awesome people. Welcome to the porch little greenhouse. I got everything back out on the porch. The video from yesterday, I posted it a couple days late, but I got it out. But we have, gotta flip this around, all the shelves pretty much full. And I don't know how much I've spent. I don't want to know. But we have fruit coming in already. And we got more here. Got corn down there. A few other things. It's looking pretty luscious. Now, I don't know how to pause this. So bear with me. And we will come on in. I purchased this yesterday. Along with this. And that was like $52. I've got onion starts going over here. So I'm cloning now. There's my there we go. So I wrapped some paper towel around there with a twist tie. How that sucker. That's a big sucker. I got another one. It's not a very big sucker at all. Find my finger. There we go. So I picked two leaves off there and I wrapped it. So I'm going to keep them wet. And the other clones are back here. Doing pretty good. That's a site cloner. I've used it before. Did pretty good. Now I got some raspberry branches from someone. I didn't get them in here fast enough. They're in the back corner. You probably can't see them. But I got some celery from the store. Didn't need it in time, but I was able to get it to regrow. There's like five heads of lettuce there. I think three are growing. Maybe this fourth one, and this one's today. Some of them I dipped in a Hormodin 3. A couple of these tomatoes I dipped in Hormodin 3. I loaded this with water and I let it sit about 12, 16 hours because I'm still in the city and I wanted the, what do you call the, the chlorine and the water to dissipate a little bit. So I also had some uh, other things going on. So I had some peas that I got. Looks like I got some new flowers coming in. So we want to self-pollinate. So the peas I had no, sprouts. The sprouts that I got from the store, I was going to put them on a salad, but I decided to fill a, uh, a bowl with water. There's some flowers there too. So, now they're starting to sprout. I put some of those in the cloner as well. And uh, take that out. Soon, I'm going to get my grow on. We got uh, another day of rain, another day of thunderstorms. So I'm kind of hesitant right now. I'm kind of waiting. I'm due to this. There we go. So I got to mow first. I didn't get another lawnmower yet. So I'm debating. I got the money for it, just got paid. It's payday. So that's cool. I'm still, still working there all through this crazy time. Uh, so maybe I'll get a lot more today. But what I'm trying to do, and I got the stimulus check, but I'm still looking at it as I'm broke. I got to think it through. I got to make a list of what I need, what I want, what really needs to happen with some of the open projects that I have so that I can get everything taken care of properly. Make sure that money goes to where it really needs to go. I might need some more fence. The fence I have now just might end up being trellises uh, and not just keeping animals out yet. So uh, I'm going to probably go around family farm and home, uh, some farm supplies, uh, Lowe's Menards, 
and just take a notebook with me and just start writing down stuff. That would probably be the, the best thing to do with a, a double paycheck. And uh, I've been looking at some trailers because I know I'm going to move sometime soon to get out to the country and start the real homestead. So I looked at some uh, trailers to get to the size where I want are very expensive and I don't want to spend the money all that money on one trailer but but uh, I got to think it out I got to start a savings account I guess and have everything uh, up to par but I'm just trying to plan it all out and one day at a time I know I got a ton of work ahead of me uh, some of these plants have been out for up to seven days in, in the weather but they've been in for two weeks but Today they might get planted, and I'm pretty much going to trust some of them to be holding up to the next thunderstorm coming in one or two days from now, and uh, slowly get the rest of them out there and get weatherized a little bit. And uh, on that note, you have a beautiful solar garden day. Got to find the button. I haven't used this camera in a long time. See ya.